Hey guys, it's Steve on the Guru Brew 2. I wanted to show you a couple tricks that you can use to save your printer ink. You know, that stuff's not very cheap, and if you like to print pages out from your computer screen, you know it can run into some money buying ink cartridges all the time. So here are some ways that you can minimize that. The first way, I'm just going to use my web page here as an example. Let me click on a page that has quite a bit of information on it here. This will work. I can come under my file and print like you would normally do. And most people would just click the OK button and then you might get three or four pages out. Unfortunately, maybe only one of the pages contains the information that you wanted and the other pages just go in the trash. This is unfortunate. I can show you how you can use this option right down here that says pages so you can only print out one page or two page or however many you need. Let's hit cancel and go up under file and go to print preview, okay? By doing this, you can see what the different pages will look like. You can see this is page one. And if I print this, this is what it's going to look like right here. And if I scroll down, this will be become page two. Let's say the information that I needed was on page two. I didn't really need page one. So now that I know what I'm going to get when I print, I can go ahead and close this. I can come back to file and print and I can hit the button that says pages and I can print from page 2 to page 2 and it will only print that second page that's one way that you can do it here's another tip that comes in really handy let's say I wanted to um, print this article right here this much and then I wanted to print this article right down here by highlighting the parts that you want to print, you can use the selection tool. To highlight the areas that you want to print, you simply go in front of what's to be um, highlighted, hold down the left hand mouse button, and then drag to the end, and you can see that it will highlight in blue. If I want to do more than one highlight on a page, I can hold down on my control key and go ahead and click on my left mouse button and highlight again. Now, when I go into the file and print function, you can see that selection is now available to me and I can click it. Now, when I click OK, only those two highlighted areas will print on the page and nothing else around it. This is something I use all the time, very handy. There's one more option that I want to show you. A lot of times, if you go ahead and print, you use up your color ink. And a lot of times, you know, when you're printing, you don't need it to be in full color, especially if it's a receipt or just something you're going to file away. So instead of wasting your printer ink in colors, you can print the whole thing in black and white. And black and white is generally, you know, the black ink is generally, um, the least expensive of all the inks. So if it's acceptable to click, um, print in black and white, you can actually come to your printer and hit the properties button, find the color tab, which is up here, and then click on this button that says print in grayscales, and then hit OK. And then when I print this page, it'll print in black and white and save the color ink. So those are a few ways that you can save on buying expensive ink more often. I hope it helps you out. Thanks for watching. Bye for now. I hope this video helped you out. If it did, please leave us a thumbs up and a comment if you wish. If you have your own question that you would like answered, please head over to the GuruBrewShow.com website. Click on the Ask a Tech link and leave a question and maybe we'll answer it in an upcoming show. So thanks for watching and we'll see you next time. Bye for now.